Hi guys, it's Risa. How are you? Tonight, ooh, it's steamy in here. Tonight, we're, I'm going to teach you how to make a delicious chicken and mushroom dish. Very fast, very simple, and you know my favorite word, delicious. So, um, you know, we have busy lives, so we have to do things that are quick and easy and something that, you know, a lot of us enjoy. Now, you may not be a big mushroom fan, but if you are, then this is a really yummy dish. What I've done is, you can take whatever kind of onion you like. I've used a Vidalia sweet onion. You can use a red onion. And I chopped it up and I've sauteed it with two cloves of garlic. If you like a lot of garlic, you can use a lot. Um, I used a tablespoon of olive oil and basically, you can see the steam. I've just sauteed it and uh, it smells amazing with the garlic and the mu oh, and mushrooms. How could I forget the mushrooms? Oh my goodness. So we're using the cremini mushrooms. I love them, but you can use whatever mushrooms you like. And I use just a package of sliced cremini because fast and easy and done, right? The other thing I like to use, um, now you can use whatever chicken you have, and I'm using Pinty's chicken. I have three chicken breasts cut up. At 100 grams, it's two smart points. So this is going to make for a few days. If you're just making for yourself or you're making for your family, you can decide um, if you want to use more chicken or not and just double the recipe. Easy. So I've cut it up into chunks. I'm going to now add it to my onions and mushrooms. Super easy. And I'm going to saute it like that. Really easy. So we've got the onions, the mushrooms, fresh garlic, which I love. Gives it such an amazing, oh my God, I wish it was smell-a-vision or smell-a-video. And it smells incredible. And you're just going to let it get warmed up and put that in. Now, what I found at Walmart is this cream of mushroom soup. Um, now, you can find whatever one you like. And if you don't want to use cream of mushroom, you can use probably any kind of a soup. But this is very low for the whole can, which is one cup. It's two smart points. So for the chicken, it's six smart points because um, I use three. For this is two. That's eight. For the olive oil for one tablespoon is three. That's 11 for the whole meal um, for this part of it. So I've measured out a cup of the mushroom soup and I'm just going to pour it in. Now, if you like it really thick, then just leave it like that. I'm just going to mix it through. And it's so creamy. Um, if you're going to double it, you could add a second can. Again, only two smart points for the whole can. Now we need to to da dazzle it up a little bit. So we're gonna add a little bit of some pepper. Use whatever amount you like. My other favorite, you know, is my Frank's hot sauce. So I'm gonna put a little bit. If you don't like it spicy, don't put any in. If you do, add as much as you like. So I'm just putting that in, and now I'm gonna stir it up. Really, really easy. Mm -mm -mm. And you want a little bit of flavor, so I'm going to add a little bit of oregano, but you can use some Italian seasoning. I was just seeing if I had some here, but I'm just going to use a little bit of some oregano. And whatever spices you like. If you like um, fresh basil, fresh thyme, um, I didn't have any in the house, so some fresh parsley. Um, you can do whatever you like. That's one thing that's so great about these recipes. Now, how long did that take me? It's done. And that's it. This is it. Beautiful. Smells delicious. Easy. And you're thinking, okay, what else can I have with it? Well, I've steamed up some vegetables. I have some broccoli and some, I have some um, asparagus. And I have some leftover zucchini that I made last night. Like I showed some people on my Facebook page, Reese's Recipes and Weight Watchers Tips. So you can even add this to it. 
um, if you'd like. Um, my husband made some white rice, and I love white rice. You can use brown rice, you can use zucchini noodles, you can use squash, um, spaghetti squash, whatever you like. If you want to make it low carb, you can do that as well. And I'm just going to add some, um, probably about a half a cup of some white rice um, in over, under it, under it, over it, whatever you want. Um, so that's what it is tonight. And I want to show you, I've just made a delicious chocolate, delicious um, little uh, uh, cake. And I'm going to be making this for you very soon and showing you how to make that. So you can have a guilt-free uh, dish um, dessert. Okay, so let's taste it. Oh, it's so delicious. It looks so nice and thick. Mmm. Easy, fast, delicious. Again, if you want to use beef, you want to use um, other kind of meat that you have, um, you've made a barbecue chicken and you don't know what to do with it, easy peasy. Um, you can buy the chicken already made. You can bake it in the oven and then add it. And that's it. So here we go. This, this whole pan. Um, and uh, it's fantastic. So I hope you like this video. And you have a great day or night whenever you're watching it. And remember to visit me on my uh, Facebook page, Reese's Recipes and Weight Watchers Tips. Bye, guys.